This is going to be a video where I try to show you how easy it is to feed a baby Malagasy cat-eyed snake. First you just uh, take the baby and uh, what I do is I gently hold the baby behind the back of its head and then you can see it's a pretty good sized pinky for him but he won't have trouble with it. And what I do is I'll take the pinky and then I'll just use the snout of the pinky to kind of get his mouth open and once he kind of opens his mouth then he will chomp down on the pinky come on buddy there you go see him bite it and now he just i let him go and he'll eat the whole thing it's that simple this is a great way to get them going early. Um, I had eight babies hatch out um, on their first shed. All eight of them ate this way. Uh, this is their second meal. And as you can see, they um, will grab a hold of it. He's a little bit nervous because I'm standing over him as I talk. Um, but he will eventually work that down as long as I don't do any kind of too sudden uh, movement above him. Uh, he will also um, uh, take it down if I put him in a tub. That's what I normally do is I will put the, give them the, the pinky, they'll bite it, and then I'll put them back in their tub gently and close the tub and that gives them a little more privacy to take it down. Um, this is a great way to get them going on rodents and on frozen thawed. Generally, I'll feed them this way for a couple of months, uh, five days in between feedings. Um, they'll grow quickly. They'll get used to eating frozen thawed um, mice. And generally after that, if you just drop one in their tub and leave them in overnight, uh, they'll take it down. Uh, but they do pretty well once they've once they've adjusted to eating this prey, and as you can see, it's not really difficult to get them to, to feed. Um, some will feed off frozen thawed just left in their tub from the get-go. Um, some of them will feed on live just left in their tub, but I found this the simplest way to just quickly get them to eat, slide their tub back in, and um, kind of assures that they're going to be getting enough food to, to build, put some body weight on. So that's my procedure and I hope that helps you in uh, your feeding of baby Malagasy cat eyes.